now let's go to the next section. And we can go ahead and make that div like little divide part. And the next section is going to be gallery. Gallery, gallery. You can even style it right here too. Take the features. Killing it, killing it. And this will be gallery. Gallery styles. All right. Woo! Are you pumped? Because I am. I, I can be done right there. No, no, no. We want it full. So gallery, okay. <clears throat> Let's go section, class equals gallery. Good. So now everything within that. Get some space. Okay. Let's go tab, save that. So you can go ahead and grab this section right here. I mean this class, gallery. Enter, enter, period, gallery, curly braces. And let's go padding, 100 px, top and bottom and zero, right to left. And let's give it a background of E, F, E, F, I'm doing threes. I need E's, E, F, E, F, E, F. Good. All right, there you go. Okay, and now, <clears throat> and now back to the HTML. Let's give it an H1, and we've already styled H1s, so it will clean it up. Uh, what do we want to call it? Traveling gallery. Traveling gallery. There you go. Traveling gallery. Save. Good. It's nice. Right in the middle. All right. Now let's start structuring this section. So we got div, and let's go class equals container, good. Next, we're gonna also make a row of columns. So we got, we got div, Hello, I need my tags. Div class equals row. And my columns are going to be, I'm not forgetting it this time, div class equals Call dash md dash three. All right. Boom. Good. Very good. Enter that. Okay. And now let's go div class equals gallery box, because we're going to be little boxes. We'll call it gallery box. Mm. 
Nice. And within this box, we're going to put a picture. So IMG. 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 SRC equals. Ooh. Stop yawning. Um, images forward slash. And because it's like that travel gallery section, we're going to put travel one. That'll be the first picture we're going to use. And then close that. And inside of that, let's put some text in there. And this one we're going to put... Ow. We're going to put uh, jet ski. H4. Jet. Ski. Say it. All right, let's look at that. Woo! Look at that. Jet skiing. People jet skiing. Okay. So let's style that section first. Okay. Jet ski. So what we're going to do is... Where are we at? We're going to gallery box right here. Gallery 2Ls, yes. Okay. Gallery. Grab that class. Put it over here. Period. Paste that thing. Curly brace. Enter. All right. And we're going to do width. That thing is way too big on our site right now. Width, 100%, semicolon, and then border radius, keep it round, keep it round, let's curve the edges, 10px, all four sides, and we're going to change the cursor so when you like put your mouse on the thing, it will look like a pointer. Cursor, pointer, Whew. semicolon, uh, oh, let's be more specific, we're talking about the image here, IMG, good, nice, look at that, look at this, okay, smooth, now what we're going to do, is go ahead and take that again copy this and then we're going to use a pseudo class judo not judo pseudo class put those two dots and put hover so that when the mouse goes on it when it hovers over it this is what's going to happen it's going to transform Transformers, robots in disguise. Transform, scale, 1.1. Boom. So now, boom, you see that? I float my mouse on it, it grows. 1.1. See what happens if I put a 2. Whoop! <laughs> Let's keep it clean. 1.1. 1 .1. All right. Okay. Now, mm -hmm -hmm. right here, gallery box, my H4. I want it to be actually on the picture. So H4, curly brace, boom. Let's go display. Block, color, white, nice, white, nice, um, text, shadow, it gives it a little pop to it, text shadow, negative 2px, this, remember I said, is the horizontal. 
2, the next number is 2px, that's up and down, like you'll have a little shadow. Now, this, this way, let's, let's check, let's check. And then this px would be the blur radius, like how much it blurs. And then last would be the color. Let's go one, two, three. Say, all right, so let me just check. Yeah, okay, okay. So negative, it's going to the left, if you're looking on the screen. The negative two is over here. And then you see how it's slightly tilted up? That is the plus two, okay? Like, look, if I put this as a positive, it'll be more to the right now. See how the blur moves to the right? But we're gonna put it to the negative. So that's to the left. Got it, got it. Okay, boom, boom, boom. And then this one, if I did negative, that means it's going, oh, negative is going up. Okay, okay, on the second one. This, horizontal, this, vertical, negative going up, positive, going down. Nice, okay. Jet ski, jet ski. Let's keep going. Font size. Let's adjust that size. Font size is 20px. Gonna raise that a little bit up. Font weight. 600. Position. Let's go absolute, absolute, absolutely. Top, whoa, 50%. Uh, left, 50%, 50%. Left, 50%, okay. And now let's transform. Transform. Translate. Yes. Negative 50%, comma, negative 50%. And that should allow it to show up on the middle. Uh oh, spaghetti! -o. <sighs> All right, where is it? All right, let's check it out. Uh, transform, translate, negative fifty, comma, negative fifty. There, okay. I got fifty over here at the top, fifty at the left. Position absolute, 620, negative, do, 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 and we got block. Uh, oh, you know what? Let's adjust this first. Take this gallery box, paste that, curly brace, um, position, relative and then margin bottom 30 px boom let's check that out there you go anytime you got an error don't panic and uh, just look through your code and you may have just left something out all right all right all right, so we got our next one, our first box for uh, our traveling gallery. So we're going to actually make three more, but we never repeat ourselves in code. We keep things efficient, efficient, so copy-paste is a great tool. 
So what we're going to do is we're going to grab our column again. Column, and we are going to keep two divs right here. One, two, one, two. Right there. Copy that. Paste. Paste. One, two, three, four. Total of four. I'll minimize it just so it's easier for you guys to see. Just to make sure that you're good. 15. So we got column three. And then we got our two divs right there. Again, that's one, two, three, four. And at the very bottom, you got one, two, three, four divs. <laughs> Good. All right, now let's save that. Uh, let me zoom back in for you guys to see. Uh, right here, right here, right there, yes. And uh, 32. All right, boom, 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 and now let's look at our page. Got one, two, three, four, awesome. Now we gotta adjust that. So let's do, so the first one we want jet skis. The next one we're gonna do travel two. It's that travel two picture. And that one is meals. Um, travel three picture, I put paddleboard, and then travel four, uh, what was I put, what did I put, entertainment, entertainment, save it, and voila, and pa pow, sick, huh? Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. And look at that. You can flow right through that then. Sweet. All right. How about that? How does that look? That looks sweet. Boom. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And that might be one too many dip. Let's just see. Container. Container. Row. Row. And then div, 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 div. No, that's good. Div, 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 div. That's good. All right. Very good. Good job. And now you've completed the gallery. Created the gallery. Nice, nice, and nice.